The FMCSA today announced the much-anticipated, long-awaited hours of service changes. Key is that while they were announced today, they do not become effective until 120 days after they're published in the Federal Register. There are four main areas of changes. Let's take a look at them. The short haul exception has been changed. It's been extended to 150 air miles and now allows for a 14 hour work shift. Drivers and carriers using the short haul exception are not required to use record of duty status or electronic login devices, nor are they required to take a 30 minute break. However, they remain subject to the existing limit of 11 hours spent driving. Next is the adverse driving condition. It expands the driving window during adverse driving conditions up to an additional two hours. A driver who encounters adverse driving conditions has up to a 16 hour window within which to complete 13 hours of driving. This expands the existing provisions to include knowledge of either the driver or the motor carrier at the applicable points in time. Also added was the word immediately to clarify when the applicable conditions must be known. And now the adverse condition can be either unusual road or traffic conditions with either scenario now qualifying. The 30 minute rest break is the next change to the FMCSA hours of service regulations. Out is the eight hours on duty, in comes the eight hours of driving time. Also, it allows any non-driving duty status to qualify as break time, be it off duty, sleep or berth, or now on duty, not driving, when it's being loaded, unloaded, paperwork, or any combination of non-driving duty status time. Final where is the sleep or berth exception. You can meet the 10 hour requirement with at least seven hours in the sleeper instead of the current eight. Also, there is a minimum off duty period is now two hours and it can be spent inside or outside of the sleeper berth. And that's provided that the two periods together total at least 10 hours. When paired together, neither of those two periods counts against the 14 hour driving window. Those are the changes as always. Thank you to the drivers out there bringing us what we need on a daily basis. You are the lifeblood of America. More information, check out our webpage. Stay safe.